Okay, now I can. Now I'm here. Okay, sweet. Uh, okay. This is this is the Legend of Zelda game that generally can't get on with it. Like it just it's good, but it just. It just can't. It can't do its story. Because it just keeps going. And I'll, oh man. I forgot how bad this look, this game looks. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. What is going on here? Okay. What's going on? Uh oh. Okay. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's kill that. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> this game was my freaking childhood, but I never, I never got to play it, uh, for GameCube, so... I won't know the map at all. Everything in this version of uh, Twilight Princess is how the game is intended to be, layout-wise. Um, but yeah, everything, everything's uh, reversed uh, horizontally because uh, because when they did it first, first uh, Wii, they had to make Link right-handed. Because Link is normally left-handed. So I can't. I'll be honest. I, I, the story that starts out here is really boring. So I'm just gonna, <laughs> just gonna skip through it as much as I can. <laughs> oh, sweet. Ah. Uh. Okay. Hey. Okay. Okay. Oh shit, that's reversed. Okay. Wow, that's okay. That's really counterintuitive. Everything I remember about this game is like the opposite of what it should be. Okay, so if I'm doing this right then Yeah. Oh wow, it's just all reversed. Okay, bye. Hey -ya! Oh shit. Wow, the controls of this game. I always forgot how much garbage they were. I guess I was always playing on Wii, so that's what they built the game for. Okay, come on. No! Not dismount. Wow. <laughs> yep. Yep. Yes, okay, good. 
This is stupid. <laughs> they have to collect all the golden eggs! Then as soon as you collect the eggs, you have to go on the egg mission to hatch your eggs. This is the stupid part about the Wii era, that all of this game, and all this game design was like made for you to like learn how to use the Wii controller, right? And now that it's not a Wii game anymore, nobody cares, because... <laughs> I'm just running with the Xbox controller. Oh, God damn it. So this is what the good thing about the Breath of the Wild is, right? Because like, it just like doesn't... It doesn't do all this bullshit. It just gets everything out of the way, and then you're playing, <laughs> then you're playing Breath of the Wild. This one, this one's like, ah, oh, you, you, you first have to fight the monkeys. <laughs> I don't want to fight the monkeys. I just want to, I just want to be the hero. <laughs> but instead, I have to deal with these fucking kids. And look at these kids' foreheads. Um, uh, I remember correctly, there's like a chest around here or something. Not yet. Oh yeah, there's one down here. I guess the chest isn't up, isn't there yet. God, what a stupid game. I don't know why. And the tank controls are the are first.
Haha, <laughs> fuck you, monkey. Get wrecked! Fishing rod. Ah. Yeah, let me just. Jesus. Okay, lady. <laughs> okay, I have a bird. Gonna... Gonna bird that bird. 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 Hey! <laughs> 
That's definitely the star. It has the cat door on it and everything. Ghost, where you going, buddy? <laughs> Damn. <sighs> yeah, this brings memories back, but my, uh, I honestly think that this, uh, this, like, level layout is just really unintuitive. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Okay, let's uh... Dirty rupees! Mess around and see what we can get. Have to go look under a bunch of rocks and shit. Oh no! I didn't want to do that. or anything like that? Okay, one more rupee. Okay, there we go. Okay. Slingshot.
Okay, let's go get some more bee larva and then go get some slingshot stuff going on. doesn't get into it like it needs to just like it just needs to get right into it you know and the problem is is that it's like so like intent on like getting you into the tutorials that it just like has like some intolerable moments like I should be playing the game now but like I'm not because <laughs> freaking Twilight Princess wants to Wants to introduce me to everything. See, I'm gonna get a sword now. And I just wanna play the game, but like, it won't let me. Do the tutorial. That there's no crosshairs or anything. Oh my god. I'm just like eyeballing it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Fantastic. Ugh. Fine, I'll show you how to use the sword. Yeah. Cool. Great. Good. charging or anything, you just hold it. Ah yes, the four attacks. stupid yeah. game. I'm sorry. Yeah. 
Alright, here we go. Yes. Great. Good. Nothing. Because there's going to be a bug in there eventually, yeah. It's like the whole thing. I know there's a task at hand, but like... just doesn't want to go. I forgot. Okay. Let's go alone. or something like that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Fuck, I, I forgot how just like awful the music at the beginning of the game is. And then like for the rest of the game, like it's like absolutely awesome. <laughs> I think after, after Breath of the Wild, everything else just doesn't hold up the same way it used to, you know? What's attacking me? It's just playing the evil music without... Fuck, that's frustrating. being this many enemies is it just because it's the gamecube version so it's like yeah you can just button mash so also the switch control also the switch controls are like Turn oil. Yep, 
Yep. Okay, let's do that. Right. Drink that. Yeah. More lantern oil. I'm an idiot. It's so easy to accidentally press the wrong button. I didn't want to get killed by that dude. Because that is definitely a thing that does happen. <laughs> Man. Everything just like doesn't age that well, come to think of it. First part is that like it just like it brings you up to the first temple and then it just doesn't let you do anything with it. I just want to play the game, but it won't let me. Stupid. I hate this. No! like beaver bother except <laughs> oh, oh it's so bad I forgot how bad it is it's like mandatory like how do you deal with this I hate this <laughs> I hate it so much I just want to save Hyrule, but you're like, the story still hasn't started yet. It's been like, probably like a half an hour, and I still haven't gotten to the story. Cause they're like, have you, how many, how, how many goats can you herd? Hey, 
Okay, come here, you go. Just go, thank you. for the mayor today must be nice okay yep going on an errand okay but how do I So I need to... Get your horse, Link. Okay. Gave the kids my sword. <sighs> okay. Okay, now the kids have my sword. means that I'm gonna have to get the metal sword next. And that'll be my sword for the rest of the game. Until I get the master sword. Hey. 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 
This game, just let me, just let me go on my adventure. They won't let me. Oh, is this when bad things happen? Gave her a bath. Okay, I'll come home safely. I'm a, am I a wolf now? I forget. Spooky dude.
I miss this game. Time to have that jingling sound for the rest of the game. Oh, my God, and remember when Midna's like dying and stuff, and it's so sad. I started. Never mind. <laughs> Oops. Alright, I want to be in here. I 
I just forgot how Twilight Princess looked. Like, I don't remember it looking this bad. I guess I was just a kid. I guess I really just don't remember this game. There we go. There we go. Let's do the sad part. 
Come on. I just want to play the game. Please, just let me play. Ah. There's so much just like rando story stuff that gets in the way of this game. Whoa, no, not that. I don't want to fight those. Try gonna stick me because if it's gonna stick, <sighs> okay, that's tolerable. Okay, let's just go. Let's just go. No, Okay, what am I doing? supposed to go. Hey! 
There we go. I always like this one uh, story because it starts out like Link is just like some villager kid who doesn't know Zelda. Like, Breath of the Wild like establishes very clearly that like they find out who has the Triforce and then like specifically uh, make sure that they that person is protecting Zelda, right? But this one's like, yeah, somebody has the Triforce. He has no idea who he is, and I guess this is our link in this one. Once the kingdom of Hyrule, but that blasted kingdom has been transformed by the king that rules the twilight. It's been turned into a world of shadows ruled by creatures who shun the light. Okay, show me. Oh, now we get spooked by Xant. Content that this is the best uh, Zelda design. Zelda looks the most rad in this one, specifically. Ah, oh, that looks so good. That holds up really well. That hero shot, holy wow. being live rendered it's not a pre-rendered cinematic it's <laughs> Decade old at this point? Like 12 years old? It's like the first game I owned for Switch, or for Wii aside from Wii Sports, which everybody owned. Twilight covered Hyrule like a shroud, and without the light, people became as spirits. Within the twilight, they live on unaware that they have passed into spirit forms. All the people know now is fear. Fear of a nameless evil. The kingdom succumbed to twilight, but I remain its princess. so sad. Okay. Actually, find it to be quite livable. I mean, is Perpetual Twilight really all that bad? And, uh, this is no time for levity. The Shadow Beasts have been searching far and wide for you. Why is this? 
Why indeed? You tell me. <laughs> Time has grown short. The guard will soon make his rounds. <coughs> you must leave here quickly. I can fight him. So clearly engineered for like CRT TVs. part very well, to be honest. Time to get a sword and shield. <laughs> I have to steal that sword and shield. It is that sneak mission part. <laughs> Um... 
Okay, I need to get a sword. But the shield comes first, right? Oh! Still got her if you're on her. Ah. Okay. to summon a bird. That shield. Right? Where's the shield again?
<laughs> Man, I forgot. Fuck, I don't remember anything about Wardon. Uh It sucks cuz like This way. <laughs> Jeez. Back so much memory. Wow. I forget what spirit you are, linear or something like that. kind of one thing I kind of wish they they kept in like Breath of the Wild because like all the landmarks are still there
the entire kingdom has been reduced to another world ruled by the cursed powers of darkness. The blight will not stop with Hyrule. Before long, the entire world of light will fall into the hand of the king of the twilight. discovered your true power. Those transformed by twilight usually cannot recover their original forms. Unless if you were to re return to Ferret Woods where you were first transformed, if you were to revive the light spirit, there by the power of light spirit you may find the means to regain your other state of being. Okay, well let's let's turn back into a into a boy. Yeah. Got my sword and shield. Got Minna by my side. You can't go back if you go here. They're now covered in twilight. You might not be able to go. Go. Got that. Whoa! Man, I always remember this game kind of spooking me out as a kid. Cause like everything just looks so like demure. I forgot that Minda is like such a little shit for the majority of this entire game. She kind of sucks because like her design is so cool. Actually, my first question is: Has somebody made like a 3D printable uh, Minda helmet? Because I I would definitely want to make that. where I learned to do the three. Harder on GameCube. <laughs> oh yeah, 
let's do it again. I like how the game is just like is to completely aware of like you just straight up getting eaten. So let's do it. Give it to you until you have it. Until you ask for it, right there. Okay, there we go. Was I this way? There we go. Okay, let's talk, buddy. Please be careful. These woods have changed. The dark clouds of dust cover this land. This drape of shadows is called twilight. In this twilight, those who live in the light become as mere spirits. It is a place where the dark ones and evil creatures dwell. That's not true. Midna's not evil. I am a spirit of light. Blue-eyed beast, look for my light. Retrieve the light stolen by the dark beast and keep it in this vessel. Vessel of light. Oh man, I forgot how much of a fetch quest this is. In the shadows of twilight, the dark insects are as visible as normal beings are here. Fetch quest. Okay. It's always kind of a fun thing that there there is like a, there's like a twilight version of almost every creature. These always, these were always coming out like around the time of uh, Twilight, the actual film, and so like Twilight Princess, Twilight were like. Man, oh my God! Why didn't we call girls who were like way too into Twilight Twilight princesses? That would have been great. Wait, why, the, why would there be something special here? I'm already. Okay. And also, like the 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 Twilight thing, like certainly helped them like do like a bunch of backtracking and like you got to basically explore the level twice.
Fucking fetch quest, man. It's all ridiculously unnecessary, too. Was I already there? I was. Okay. Go get the other bugs, I guess. Cause I guess I either like. I guess I glossed over them. I remember they like re reduced the the amount that you had to get in half, like in the HD, because they realized how fucking annoying this is. Oh. 
Give it to me. Okay. Guess there's one more in the middle of it all. One more time. in the house. Man, I forgot about all this. Okay. Cool. Let's go. Let's do it. Twilight has been eliminated. Yes. Oh, and am I ha am I cute now too? <gasps> Come on. 
Come on. Ooh. I forgot how much this, like, this specific, uh, Zelda is like a huge inspiration for Breath of the Wild as far as like the swirly designs go. I am one of the spirits of light who dwell in Hyrule. By the order of the gods, I protect this forest. Hey, good job, buddy. Oh, brave youth. In the land covered in twilight where people roam as spirits, you were transformed into a blue-eyed beast. That was a sign. It was a sign that the powers of the Chosen One rest within you, and that they are awakening. Look at your awakened form. Ah! The green tunic that is your garb once belonged to the ancient hero chosen by the gods. His power is yours. His is the true power that slept within you. Your name is Link. You are the hero chosen by the gods. Brave Link. A dark power rests in the temple deep within these woods. It is a forbidden power. Long, long ago, I and the other spirits of light lock it away. Because of its nature, it is a power that should never be touched by any who dwell in the light. But this world weeps beneath the mantle of shadows, and so there is no choice. You must pass the king power of the king of shadows. If you would seek this forbidden power, then proceed to the temple in the forest depths. Okay. Seems like a solid start to our adventure. Okay, let's uh let's save a state. Okay, I think that's it for the night. You know, we learned a lot. We uh we got the we got the story out of the way. We're on to temples now, and it's gonna be it's gonna be a hell of a Twilight Princess adventure. Everything is new again. Uh, I am clearly not just trying to seek my uh, original childhood uh, memories and yeah. <laughs> okay. Fantastic. Have a good one.